Hello and welcome to another episode of Puddle Face Off. After I reviewed the uh, Northern Mauler, I thought to myself, chainsaw side, distortion side, I already own such a pedal. Therefore, today's contestants, the Northern Mauler and the Clitone Grindstein. So as you can see, both pedals do have lots of knobs. The Northern Mauler has eight and the Grindstein even has nine knobs and one switch. The other difference is that the Grindstein does have an FX loop that you, where you can basically bypass the well amp side of the Grindstein and basically implement your own distortion circuitry, which the Northern Mauler doesn't have. Okay, so what do we have? We have two sides. Uh, we have an amp side where we have gain, bass, treble. And here we have mids, treble, bass. Then we do have a master volume. We have a master volume here as well. The gain is the giver here and it works for both, well, basically sides. Then we have the mix control here. It's called blend. And on the chainsaw channels, we do have high grind mid cut, and here we have bite and growl. Plus, we do have a boost on the grindstein that works on both channels. So we have everything on noon. Oh, and here we do have a face flip. Everything on noon except boost here. We have the mix to the regular distortion circuit blend as well. Let's head over to the EQ curve. So very similar, the Northern Mola seems to be a bit more on the high cut side and the low cut. So let's crank the volume. Let's see how high we can get. French line has way more output. Okay, but at noon they're about similar. So travel. works better on the Northern Mauler now base. Subtle. And we do have the mids here. Okay, and when we add gain, we add some more base. It doesn't seem to do anything. Okay, let's switch to the uh, chainsaw side. You can already see that the Grindstein does have a chainsaw implemented and on the Northern Mauler we actually have to dial it in. And it's way broader. And with the growl we add some bass. We don't have a bass function on the Grindstein. But we do have a high. And we do have a mid cut. And the face doesn't do anything. With the boost, nothing happens because it's distortion. Okay, so those look very different, but let's find out if they do sound differently. For the review part, I'll be doing three different tonal comparisons. First, both pedals into a clean amp. After that, both pedals into the FX return of basically a tube power amp. And last not least, the pedals just into an IR and I chose the Black Path IR that comes when you purchase the Grindstein.
Which pedal did you prefer? Do you think the Northern Mola made it or do you think the Grindstein was superior? Or do you think both are equal? Let me know down in the comment section. And if you want to support this channel, you might want to consider checking out the links in the description or becoming a YouTube member. And with that being said, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. May the power protect you and have a nice day.